Hey what's up guys, welcome back to another Call of Duty Mobile video. I am Abi, and today. I am going to teach you how to win every single solo versus squads match easily. So be sure to stick to the end of this video, and I assure that you won't regret after watching it. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and turn on bell icon so that you won't miss any of my tips and tricks videos in future. Without any further ado let's get started. Please! First of all, landing. There are two types of players, survivor and aggressive player. If you're a survivor then land as far as you can to avoid initial fights. If you're aggressive like me, then land somewhere near the plane path. I decided to land on platform for good loots and initial kills. Anyway, while dropping down remember always to use the I button to check how many enemies are dropping with you and their position. This helps you to land safe and gets enough time to kill one by one. Try to have these things before you fight anyone. 1. Good weapon. 2. Level 2 or level 3 vest, as level 1 is pretty much useless. 3. Try to get adrenaline to boost you. Extra 50, but this is optional. I heard enemy footsteps from the top, so I had to push this one and kill him fast before his teammate arrives. Try to take cover as soon as you kill one enemy. Before his teammate approaches me, I rushed him and killed easily. In solo vs squads game, it's really important for you to have helicopter. You get to choose when you want to land on a squad, and also you get the high ground to survive enemy first. It's also the fastest transportation. Always get the high ground, whether it's a building, mountain whatever makes you higher than enemies. Here is one example, how easy to wipe a squad with high ground. Try to take one enemy at a time, if you fight more than you might probably end up getting killed. Look how easy it is when you take high ground. See this could have been my end, if the enemy have good accuracy. Now I know where he is, it's easy for me to reposition and kill him. I am sure he will be watching me out at the same location. Always reposition, never stay in the same spot, try to flank as much as you can, that gives enemy no idea how to approach you. Easy! Watch out, the revived flight will arrive. Never take open fights, it's always end up getting killed. Try to use smoke, or else stay. The fight only if you have cover. Important tip after repairing your vest always reset it. With med aid or adrenaline, you never know when the situation comes to fill up your health. Never fire at enemies back unless you are pretty sure you can knock him down because our small mistake can ruin the entire situation and turns upside down. In this case, I know. My both guns are close range weapon, it's hard for me to knock him with this distance, so. Decided to go a little closer so I can clean swipe him without giving him a chance to think.
Always keep an eye on the minimap for enemies' movements. When you are going for a loadout choose gun according to your strength, in my case I prefer to take a close and mid-range fight. So I choose my Fennec first, then AK or M4 LMG for medium range. This is totally up to you, choose whichever guns that fits your play style. Revisit the areas where you killed an enemies, there is a possibility that you can kill the same enemies again and again, helps you to gain more kills. Another good strategy to take third partying, this squad is busy fighting another squad. They will be distracted and maybe lower an HP. First of all, keep flying in the area and try to figure out the best position to land at. I heard this squad was using sniper, it's easy now for me to jump directly with my Fennec. Keep your close range weapon handy, it helps in these kind of situations. It's easy at this point for me to kill him and get ready for the next fight. Never stand still, always try to move, slide, jump, this helps you to survey at any kind situations. Especially it's hard for the enemy to hit the bullet on you. priorities to upgrade your class, not all the classes required the upgrade, but the certain classes do. Don't use the class unnecessarily, you may not know when the moment will comes. Snowboard also plays a major role in a winning a battle royale game. It's not a much rare item like Vest or Adrenaline. You can also find it when you loot enemy box. Tips to use. When you use snowboard, don't stand still, always use it while running this gives a good speed for you. Alright guys, that's are all the tips and tricks for today's video. Also, this match was not so intense as I wiped many squad initially. Got easy at the end with couple more enemies and bots left will do more such videos in near future. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and comment below your opinions about this video. Bye. 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 Bye.